are a couple of tips and tricks that one uh, should uh, keep in mind as you're using the hook. Uh, for example, pointing the uh, the cutter towards one direction versus the other direction, knowing which direction you're cutting, um, and knowing that you're cutting on in all four quadrants. What I typically t teach my fellows uh, when they first start using hawk is that we aim the little C channel, the cutter, or what I call the Pac-Man, towards, towards one side and then the other side. So in my clinical practice, what I typically do, especially for a long segment uh, CTO, for example, or where there's multiple areas that we have to perform atherectomy on, I usually aim the Pac-Man towards one side first. For example, what I always, almost always do is aim it towards the lateral side of the vessel. And then my next direction is actually going to be medial. So I know for sure I've gotten 180 degree turn. Uh, then I start back on the lateral side and then I either counter clock or I clock about 90 degrees. So I clock, uh, I do one AP cut, and then my last cut is going to be the opposite direction. So if I had clocked initially, then I go back to my lateral position and I counter clock so that I can achieve essentially a 360 cut. Um, after my initial four cuts, I do typically take an angiogram. Sometimes I do an IVIS as well to understand how much debulking I had achieved and whether or not more cuts are necessary to really gain the lumen that I need to deploy a drug-coated balloon.